As we continue down the Danube, our scenic Jewels of Europe river cruise is taking us through Germany's most beautiful bergs, and today it's Nuremberg. Nuremberg was made infamous worldwide as the site of the Nazi party rallies in the 1940s. And chosen as a site of the War Crimes Tribunal after World War II. These days it's shaken off that unenviable history and is known for much more enjoyable pastimes. Nuremberg is considered to be the mecca of gingerbread. They've been baking it here for over 600 years and I'm about to learn from the masters. My name is Fritz and um, I'm doing the gingerbread class today um, with you. This cooking class is one of Scenic's free choice options, where you choose an included tour that best suits you and your interests. A teaspoon of cinnamon. Oh, these spices smell amazing. Yeah. In teams of two, we're making what the Germans call Lebkuchen. So we're chopping the peel nice and fine. This is lovely. So gingerbread man is a very British thing. And the German Lebkuchen is always um, in a round form on top of a wafer. So just rotate it while you are uh, pushing with your thumb. So Fritz, our first tray is ready to go in the oven. As well as learning how to cook the traditional gingerbread recipe, we get a much welcome taste test at the end. The first ones are ready. Oh, gorgeous. Mm. <laughs> this is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. What I like about this is that it's different to any gingerbread that I've ever eaten. And I think it's because um, he's replaced the um, flour with the nuts and it gives right. it such a lovely texture. Yep. Okay. Mm. And we still have time to explore some of Nuremberg's fascinating history. So Nuremberg was hit pretty hard during the Second World War, but this place looks pretty kind of ancient. Yeah, well, that's right. Most houses around us are going back to the 14th century. That's a typical half timber design you'd find here. This place you could recall as being pretty lucky, as uh, yeah, nine out of ten houses were destroyed in Nuremberg, but this street is pretty much in its original design. After trying the famous Regensburg sausages, Sebastian is determined to convince me Nuremberg's are even better. You see the reason actually around us, if you just look at the main market right here, it is where the main trading roads, since like so ever, we're leading right to this place, the Spice Road, the Silk Road, the Amber, the Fur Road, all leading up here and developing therefore as well recipes for gingerbread and sausages. So these sausages are made for centuries already here in Nuremberg. So there's always been this rivalry between the two cities. Yeah, definitely. You could say so that there's sort of a worst war existing between Regensburg and Nuremberg. Right, or a battle of the bangers. That's right. <laughs> Nuremberg's sausage kitchen has a similar history to Regensburg, but this one was a originally created to feed the workers of the city's cathedral. But when it comes to taste, owner Hans believes there's no competition. I would say the best sausages in the world, they are here. Yeah, really, it's the best sausages. They are made every day fresh. We produce here in this little kitchen about um, five, four, five to 10,000 sausage a day. This is amazing. Here, look. There's only one way to solve this centuries-old rivalry. Forget, forget Regensburg. I've, forgot, I've <laughs> forgotten him already. They, forget they, are, they are really, really delicious. <laughs> I love the marjoram. I love yeah, it. Yeah. I love it. Yeah. I think that is your winning, yeah. your winning herb in there. You still got to mm. try it with hot mustard, though, mm. as this is the main difference as well to Reagan's group. Yeah. I just have to thank you, Sebastian, for bringing me here. I think the winner is pretty clear. Great, and then I'm happy. And the winner is Nuremberg. <laughs> <laughs> Roast. 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 That's how we do it. Roast. 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 